Hi, this is Thunder Yi from BodoWork.com and uh, yes, we finally know when uh, the iPad 3 will be announced. It is March 7th, which is next Wednesday in San Francisco. Apple uh, made that announcement today. Uh, all they said basically when sending out the invites is that something you really have to see and touch. So something you really have to see and touch is their logo and tagline and you know, a company with this uh, photo here. So pretty much indicates it's the iPad 3. Uh, what do we know? Uh, we do know it's coming out. We do know that it will be coming out to AT&T and uh, Verizon um, with the uh, at least the data formats. Um, now, what do we know for rumors? Rumors is that it will be 4G LTE compatible, which technically is a no-brainer because those two networks have 4G LTE. Also, uh, <clears throat> rumors that it will be sporting a retina display. The resolution is uh, 2048 by 1536. So this is a high pixel density display, giving you the same you know quality you got from the iPhone 4 and 4S. <clears throat> also, it will be spotting an 8 megapixel camera in the rear. Again, this is all rumors for the iPad 3, um, and will sport an A6 quad core processor. Now, spec-wise, those things are no-brainer just because uh, most of the um, other devices on the market. Um, will be especially like with the Asus Transformer Prime do you have quad core processors and also 4G LTE on the data side is also a no brainer because you do have partners, two partners that have 4G LTE so of course that makes sense. Um, <clears throat> pricing wise most likely would stay the same with the iPad 2 and of course you see a price drop there for the iPad 2 coming down. Uh, availability we expect it within a month which or even between two weeks and a month, knowing how Apple is. Uh, word also is that the casing is actually similar to the iPad 2, so which basically trying to reduce manufacturing costs. Apple is keeping things quite in line. So this is more of an upgrade um, to meet the market standards, if you will, uh, from Apple. Now the uh, events will start at uh, uh, 10 a.m. Pacific, 1 p.m. Eastern. We will be live blogging the event for you, uh, so definitely see the link there below uh check out that link and check out our live blog of the event of the ipad 3. now um you know how will this affect you know the tablet market right now apple is king in the tablet market it's that simple uh the biggest tablet in the market is the ipad the second biggest i think is the playbook i could be wrong but just numbers have changed between the playbook and the um um HTTP touchpad so it all depends but it's it's a wide margin anyway so I mean this will help keep Apple's dominance in the tablet market um, what could change that I believe is probably Windows and Windows 8 we'll find out more about the, that of course with the uh, consumer uh, preview coming up yeah, tomorrow on the 29th but anyway this is all about the iPad so <clears throat> March 7th on Wednesday uh, 1 p.m. Eastern 10 a.m. Pacific to go to board at work, check out our link and you can follow our live blog of the event and we'll cover everything that has to do with the iPad 3. Uh, a quick roundup of the rumors we know, <clears throat> we have so far, is that it will spot a retina display uh, uh, resolution 2048 by 1536, uh, quad core processor A6, 4G LTE, 8 megapixel camera, of course you have a front facing camera and stuff, uh, we'll be running iOS uh, 5 points. Uh, 5.0.1 so um, yeah the change is there so that's pretty much what we can say about the iPad 3 stay tuned till next Wednesday and uh, that's pretty much it oh also don't forget uh, subscribe to all our pages and channels again subscribe to board fam which is our new station our new channel on YouTube which should be it's different it's a whole new style so uh, subscribe to us support the work so this is Thunder saying thank you and uh, always enjoy entertainment